so you'll have to excuse any sounds you hear. Um, I believe there's some like cooking going on. Um, you'll also have to excuse me for looking like a potato. Um, <laughs> I have been working on the Paxi Awards all day and I know it won't seem like it, but that video takes me like three hours to edit. So I've been in a dark basement all day. So, however, I just got a package. <laughs> And this is from my friend MP Hunt. You guys might recognize that name. I had him on one of our poetry live streams. I also have his book, Immortalized in Ink. It's a poetry book. Uh, yeah, so uh, let's see what we got here. He messaged me and said he was gonna send me some books and that he hoped I liked them. Um, and we have this same like dark inclination, so I'm sure I will. Uh, <laughs> let's see here. Okay, of course I opened them upside down. Oh! Killer verse, poems of murder and mayhem. Monster verse, poems, human and inhuman. Oh, these look awesome. Look at this. Look how pretty. I'm sorry about the lighting, guys. You know how I do my unboxings. I literally get so excited to come up here and turn the overhead light on. The fan's even on, so the light's probably flickering. Professional YouTuber. Anyway, <laughs> look. Are so cool. I love the blood drip. I love the blood drip. Oh gosh, look at the back of that one. Look. And let's see. Oh, and there's like a sea monster kind of deal there. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, and look. It even has its own little. I love that. I love that. And they're so little. They're so cute. Look, let's see. What, what's the book at? Okay, here's Lurking in the Dark. Here's Lurking in the Dark. Here's these. You see? They're little. <laughs> Well, thank you, MP. That was so sweet of you. Oh my gosh, these are beautiful. Oh wow, I cannot wait to get... Okay, I just opened up to one. <laughs> oh my goodness, let's do the same thing with this one. On hearing the news that Hitler was dead. Oh, and the pages are really soft too. Oh, that's nice. You guys know, I don't have like a lot of new books, so when I get new books like this, I'm like, oh, look how nice and smooth they are. <laughs> MP, thank you so much. These are awesome. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to dive in. Ah! Alright guys, you know, I have no idea what you saw before this, no idea what you're going to see after, but I hope you're having a good day. Bye for now. Hello again. <laughs> so, Editing Me is going to try to remember to put this right after the last MP clip because we have more book mail from MP Hunt. Apparently, the third book he sent was just a little bit behind the other two. So, I wanted to open this one up because he messaged me and said that I would probably like this one better than the other two. So, if that intrigues me. Okay, it's orange. I'm trying to get it open. Okay, it's orange. Does this mean it's about Halloween? Oh, it is! <laughs> Poems Bewitched and Haunted. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, I just opened it up. I love the ones that have these little bookmarks. Anybody else like that? Comment down below. Let me know. Who, who likes this and who's annoyed as hell by them? Look, I opened it up to Evil Landscape. Oh, this is beautiful, too. Very, like, nostalgic Halloween pumpkins, you know? Oh, I love it. <laughs> oh, and they're like, it's like a little set now. Oh, hang on, I'll grab the other one. Okay, so here's all three of them together. Is that not beautiful? Like, ah, oh, so cool. Oh, and here, look, side by side, like that. Oh, I love it. I love the little, like, brass knuckles and guns. Oh, it's great. Oh, and look, it's got the little, <laughs> I'm, I'm just rambling at this point. Ah, so <laughs> we have three new poetry books for Panic Poetry, and all of them are freaking beautiful. Oh my gosh. So thank you again MP. I will see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> Bye for now. Hey guys. Sorry if I'm looking a little extra potato-y. Um, I don't know when you guys are going to see this because how I usually do my vlogs is I will just have like a bunch of clips and then when I have what I think is enough I put them together and that's when you get a vlog. And I literally just put one of those out. So, so right now currently it is about a week before Christmas, not even a week, and I don't feel that great <laughs> right now. I don't know what it is. I don't know if my body's just actually physically allergic to joy or what, but uh, yeah, I don't feel that great. Um, I can't 
take a deep breath without uh, coughing. So, so if the potato-ness is too much for you to handle, that's why. However, I did want to come on and tell you about two things. Number one is I am making, I can grab it, another blanket. I'm gonna make a Tetris blanket. You remember like the game Tetris? Yeah. So we'll see. Maybe I'll put that in here if it ever gets finished. If I keep feeling this way, then it might get finished sooner rather than later because that's all I have the energy for. Um, however, sorry, I think Xander sees something outside. <laughs> something really cool just happened. Biggest reason I wanted to turn the camera on was that I just got a package. <laughs> And you guys know I love to share my book mail with you all. Now this one I have already opened because I thought it was like our secret Santa thing that me and a bunch of people are doing over on Instagram, but it's not. <laughs> and I was gonna do something special for that. This is, oh my gosh, it's so heavy. Look you guys, it is the lock and key. It's the graphic novel. I haven't even taken the plastic off of it yet, but look at that, isn't that cool? This is from David Olive. <laughs> And there was a note with it, and it was just, you know, saying like, hey, thanks, you know. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to cry. This is what I, I stand in awe of, and just marvel <laughs> at the amazing things that have happened since I started this channel. The fact that I just got a book <laughs> from someone who was just like, hey, thanks for being nice. <laughs> This means everything in the whole world to me. Um, I'm not gonna cry. <laughs> uh, but yes, this is awesome. I can't wait to look through this. It is heavy as hell, oh my gosh. It is so nice. Look at the side of it. It looks like like one of those official, you know, I think I said in my Jacob, my Christmas Jacob book video, it looks like, um, like a book your grandma would have. <laughs> this is kind of one of those. It looks really super nice. And it says it's Joe Hill Gabriel Rodriguez and Jay Photos. Is it like the Joe Hill? That's pretty cool. Sorry, I had a coughing fit. Uh, <laughs> again, guys, I'm sorry if my energy's a little bit low. Um, it sucks when you can't take a deep breath. <laughs> so, but I will see you guys next time. Again, have no idea what you just saw or what you're gonna see after this. So I hope you're having a good day. Bye for now. <laughs> So I just got two packages. <laughs> this is my first unboxing that I'm doing um, for a vlog. And I can tell you guys, I don't think I've mentioned this, but I've been dealing with a lot of body dysmorphia, I guess you could say, because of the things that have happened. And I've really struggled whether or not to do this because I had to, you know, go put my hair on. <laughs> so, yeah, uh, I'm sorry if I look like a potato, but I really, really, really love unboxing stuff with you guys, and I feel like you guys like it too, so I have two things here. One, I know who it's from. The other one, I'm not sure. I think. I'm not sure. But let's open this one first. This is from Austin, Monster Blood. If you guys don't know who he is, I'll have him linked down below. He reached out. He is like the be all end all of Goosebumps R.L. Stein stuff. Okay? Like, if you want to know something about that, you go to his channel. And he reached out and he was like, hey, I've got some extra Goosebumps. Would you like me to send them to you? And just the walk down memory lane. I haven't had a Goosebumps book in my possession. Oh my gosh, years. Years and years. And I'm pretty sure. I'm 99% I'm sure I'm older than Austin, so I want to say, God, it's probably been 20 years since I last had a Goosebumps book, so let's do this. I'm excited. My favorite Goosebumps back in the day, and I didn't have many, but I remember I really loved 
Night of the Living Dummy. So let's see what this is. Oh, there's a note that's for me. I don't read my notes on camera, not usually anyway. So I'll, I'll read that off camera and cry. Don't worry, Austin. Oh, this is some of the newer stuff. Ooh, okay. Oh, cool. Oh, look, Night of the Living Dummy. <laughs> this is Night of the Living Dummy 2. Oh, I don't think I had this one. Oh, that's so cool. Oh, uh, uh, this is the Nightmare Room. Okay, see, I only know about stuff like this because of Austin's channel. This is way after my time. I knew about these kind of goosebumps. The Nightmare Room, look at that, look at that cover. It's got green eyes. Okay, let's see. Oh, the Choose Your Own Adventure ones. This is the Reader Beware, You Choose the Scare. I love Choose Your Own Adventure stuff. Oh, look, it's a demonic poodle. <laughs> Please don't feed the vampire. Oh, it says choose from 20 different scary endings. That's awesome. You guys remember when there was shit in the back of books like this? Ah, uh, those were the days, weren't they? Oh, and then another one! Oh, this is another one! The Knight in Screaming Armor. This is another Reader Beware. Look at that. I love this, like, foil cover. That's awesome. Ah, oh, so neat. Austin, thank you. Thank you. And see, you know what's really cool about these? Let me tell you what's really cool about these. Because these are easy enough reads that I can take them to treatment and maybe finish in one treatment. Okay, so these are really cool for that. And, you know, they're kind of light. Sometimes I need stuff that's light. Depends on the day. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much, Austin. Uh, okay, you guys know I save all my notes, so I will be reading this and crying off camera. Let's open the next one. I didn't bring any scissors. Ugh. One moment. Okay, we're back. All right, I have scissors. Let's open this. I don't want to say, because it doesn't say on the thing, where it's from. I think I know though. <gasps> yes, I know. All right. <laughs> yeah, and there's there's an Amazon note from it. Ah, uh, okay. This is from David over at David's Book Reviews. Horror Store by Grady Hendrix. Oh, how awesome. I didn't get to open the last few things David has sent me on camera because reasons. Um, he sent me paperbacks from Hell as well, which is beautiful. This is gorgeous. I love it. Look at that. Look at the little picture right there. You see that? I recently went, what is this after? What store is this after? Ikea. That's it. Ikea. I actually, I, I said recently. It's not been recently. It's been months. But I, I went to my first Ikea, like, 2022. <laughs> so, wi within reason. So, yeah. And I know this is supposed to be set up kind of like that. So, I'm really looking forward to this. This is awesome. And again, a manageable level. A manageable treatment level. Oh, I love it. Look, look, it's all cool on the front and then all degraded on the back. I've never seen the back of this book. That's awesome. Ah, oh, well, thank you, David. That was awesome. Well, guys, a little bit of book mail always makes my day even brighter. So, <laughs> guys, of course, it goes without saying nobody ever has to send me anything, but I can tell you that <sighs> these are such bright points. Now, you have no idea. You really have no idea just what it does to me when this happens. <laughs> oh, I'm such a bag of emotions anymore. You guys are probably sick of seeing my potato face crying. <laughs> but anyway, when the next cool thing happens, of course, I'll let you guys know. Bye for now.